be no Navy needed to beat him. Would use rockets, but this guy has anti-aircraft things everywhere. Make a couple of them just to show. Now, the reason I'm not spending too much on it, and by the way, you can see uh, when the bombs are built, they just sort of get built there. So this is what they do, they just sort of send missiles over. Now, you can't set rally points for planes, so I'm just going to have a few of my fighters go there. And seeing as bombers aren't these guys' strong suit, I'm not going to be using them. As much as I want to use these, I will be using them only in a little bit. Because right now, I just need a few units to start building the wonder here. Okay, great. So now, we can start getting infinite money. Should be built right here. This will need to be a slightly more indestructible wall. Because they will start flying forward in droves. And unfortunately, that's not a loss that can be sustained right now. Just watch, they're gonna start launching things any second now. So here's what the V2... oh crap. So here's what they do. Might as well shoot one of these out of the sky. I wasn't where you could do that, but apparently you can. So they just shot off here. Ah, somehow a plane just ninja them out of the sky. Conveniently, they're going for the wrong thing. And now, get gold as such. I just essentially get 10 every second. Mm -hmm. 
under attack. For comparison's sake, I'll make one of these uh, Panzer things, even though they kind of suck. Okay, so, now just a brief rundown here. So, I'll blast radius things get improved with uh, TNT. This is mainly just bombers and mortars. Uh, Blitzkrieg, uh, this is. I believe. Yeah, I think it's Korea that has this. Uh, basically, it makes a group of enemies take more damage for a little while. Battlefield Deception is the same as China's. Oh, hell no. Well, that's just not good at all. My blimps. Splendid. We're under attack. Also, the Spencer thing, you can see they're sort of good, better than many of the other tanks. Pretty much just is what it is. Uh, here's a bit of a cheat for the game. It allows instant production of everything. So these tanks uh, go completely F up this guy. Now show what. Oh, by the way, this is effectively what England's Wonder does. So now I get to show off these rockets. So they do something like that. I wasn't aware that you could shoot stuff out of the sky with them, so let me try that out. <laughs> That's just awesome. <laughs> yeah, you can shoot stuff out of this game. Cool. Also, in case it wasn't clear last time, that grows a tree. And here, just to demonstrate what would be my usual tactic, is to just have them fly in while some kind of other invasion's going on, and just land the infantry there. That's also what their rocket ability does. Just want to show this. Just kind of find it funny if they pull a rocket launcher out of their pocket. So oh, that's just funny. Very unwieldy camera in this. 
Well, that, um, that could have done better. Attack plan. We're under attack. Target today, on the way. So, more on the dumb AI. They will go after random units on the ground. They will go after anything at all. Take of this. What? What's the attack plan? Size matters. Orders? Splendid. The AI, AI is always resilient in this, though. With the weirdest priorities like setting up airports and docks when they don't even have a town center left. So they unfortunately never give up when it makes sense to give up. Another note, I never understood why they made all of the docks so resilient in this. Because I would think, you know, a dock, it's not exactly a very tough thing. It's built of wood, it's just made to make boats and... No. And so now they pretty much get to go after this boat and this dock because they have a bunch of subs everywhere and for some reason they think that these subs are enough not to win. Or enough to win somehow. I actually made a scenario once that essentially involved just kind of doing a whole landing using only a bunch of blimps, and it was pretty awesome, but unfortunately it was lost along with that computer. Why have you guys not given up yet, honestly? There we go. Now it finally considers it a win. So, that's about it for this one. There'll be another one shorter, shortly after, if anyone actually watches these.